Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my Hello everyone, welcome complete. back to my YouTube channel and today I am going to do the Disney Look at this stuff, isn't it neat tag. Now I was tagged by a YouTuber called Wrestling with Disney and I love her videos so much. She does Disney videos and wrestling videos. So if you want to see any of those videos, check her out, I will link her below. So the first question is my favourite Mickey Mouse item. So my favourite Mickey Mouse item, I have a lot of Mickeys, but my favourite has got to be Mickey dressed as Jack Skellington, purely because he's dressed as Jack Skellington. Now, I love Jack Skellington, I love Mickey Mouse, and combine the two together, like, it's amazing. Now, I actually didn't get these myself. I got... A personal shopper who shops in Florida to get me these which I'm very thankful for so it's just a Mickey plush Halloween plush dressed as Jack Skellington I mean how adorable is he and the thing I love most about him he's he's got these like hard feet so he can stand up anywhere and obviously Halloween has just gone by so he were on my desk for Halloween Second question is my favourite Disney artwork. Now my favourite Disney artwork is this little zero painting on a canvas. A lovely girl called, I can't remember her name now, she was on Facebook, I think it was Jen, Gemma. She did this and I just love it so much. It comes as like a fold up stand so you can stand it wherever you like on your desk and i just love it the colors on him are so beautiful like i love it so much one of my favorite pieces of art one of my favorite pieces of artwork the third question is my favorite princess item now i actually don't own many princess items purely because i collect disney dogs or disney animals but i do have one princess item is this aerial musical snow globe now this is just so beautiful i love it so much and it only costed me five pounds as well off a car boot i mean that is just amazing and it also plays the under the sea music How beautiful is that? I just love it so much. I mean, even got all the characters on it as well. Sebastian, Flounder. I mean, the artwork and the colours, they're just so pretty, aren't they? So this is my favourite princess item. The fourth question is my favourite Disney plush. And if you can't tell already or guess which one I'm going to show you... It is, of course, my baby plush Bolton blanket. I love him so much. Again, he could only get in America and a lovely lady picked it up for me. I just love him so much. Like, he's just adorable, isn't he? His ears and he's super soft and cuddly. And the main reason why I picked it is because he's a baby bolt, you don't get many baby bolts around. But also on his blanket is Rhino, the hamster, and then Mittens, the cat as well. I mean, you get all three characters in one there. And of course you can hang him up if you like as well, but I don't do that. So he is my favourite Disney Plus item in my collection. The next item is my favourite pair of Disney ears. And of course I had to go with my bolt ears. Now I got these specially made for me and I love them so much. Like I can't get over how amazing they are. And the thing I love about these is the glitter you can't feel because I'm actually allergic to glitter. Like it makes me itch so bad. But she's put plastic on top so i can't feel it which is even better so on this side we have bolt with the lightning 
and shape of his like uh, keychain. And then we have Bolt. And then on the other side, just his Lightning Bolt Strike. And on the back is Plain. And these are so comfortable. These are so comfortable to wear as well. And they're very bendy. So I love these so much. I'm very pleased with these. The next question is my favourite free Disney souvenir. I don't have many Disney souvenirs as I've never been to any of the Disney parks but it's my dream to go and I don't have a local Disney store near me but a girl on YouTube who I used to talk to did a couple of shout outs for me from my favourite Disney characters so I guess they're kind of a free Disney souvenir if not I'm sorry. So the first one I'm going to show you is my shout outs from Jack and Sally who you all know I love very much. So here are my shout outs from Jack and Sally. Uh, can you say hi to Chloe and um, Dylan? And I also got a shout out from Peter Pan, who again is one of my favourites. Um, Chloe from England wants to say hi also. Oh, hi Chloe. Uh, say hi to Wendy for me and John and Michael. Okay. The next question is my favourite Disney pin. Now, I don't collect pins, but watching more and more videos of pin mail is making me want to collect. So maybe... On my Christmas list, I may put a few pins down. At the moment, I've actually got three or four pins. So this is my favourite, and I didn't buy this. Someone gifted it to me. It is the Disney Bolt Limited Edition pin, and I love it so much. Ooh. He's just so adorable. So I'm very happy to the person who gifted this pin for me. The most sentimental value item I have in my room is this blue dopey plush. And it's the most sentimental to me is because it's the only thing I have what reminds me of my nonna. Because my nonna brought me this but she's sadly passed away and this is the only item I have which I can remember her by. And I think this was the very first Disney Plus I owned as well. She actually brought it me on Dancing on Ice when I went to see Dance on Ice when I was about five or six years old. I was very young in Sheffield. So I love this plush so much. It's the oldest plush in my room and I just love it so much. I will always remember my nonna when I watch this. When I watch this, when I see this. My favourite sidekick item is Doug, the talking dog. Now, I actually do have a talking Doug plush, but he's hidden away. So I thought I'd show this ornament instead. So this is a Christmas tree decoration, but I'm just using it as a normal uh, ornament. And he actually talks and his collar lights up. I am a great tracker. My pack sent me on a special mission all by myself. Have you seen a bird? I want to find one, and I've been on the scent. I'm a great tracker. Can I mention that? I love Doug so much purely because he's a talking dog. I mean, who doesn't want a talking dog in their life? And he's just adorable, isn't he? I love him so much. So, I love him so much. He is definitely my favourite sidekick item. My favourite Disney apparel is my again is again my Doug shirt. I love this shirt so much. It's from Primark, but they've whitewashed Doug. <laughs> He's not brown. So I don't know why they've made him white instead of brown. I'm not sure. But I just love the quote, what they've put with him. I love dogs more than people because that is definitely true. And as you can tell, I don't wear this much purely because it's too big for me. I bought the wrong size. Well, it's the only size they had and I really wanted it. So I thought I'd buy a bigger size. And another reason is because 
I don't want it to get ruined because it's literally one of the favourite Disney shirts I own. And they don't do much dug up merchandise over here. My favourite Marvel item is this beautiful group plan. Now it is actually fake but that's fine with me. The plant pot is Groot's face. I mean, how adorable is that? And I love how they've even put fake stones inside as well. I just love him so much. And he, uh, he will actually be in my next month's Disney haul as he is one of my new purchases so look out for him in my Disney haul. My favourite Star Wars item again is this stitch dressed as I'm going to say Luke Skywalker I'm not sure. I, To be honest I haven't watched all of the Star Wars I've just watched the ones with Ewan McGregor in because I love Ewan McGregor but I picked this up purely because my brother, who sadly passed away, he was a massive, massive fan of Star Wars. So I know if he had seen this, he would have definitely picked it up. So I thought I'd get it just so it could be something to remember him by. So I'm just going to say Stitch dressed as Luke Skywalker, but I'm not sure. But he is adorable, isn't he? My favourite villain item, again going with the Nightmare Before Christmas theme, is this Oogie Boogie hanging decoration. Now he is quite heavy and he also glows in the dark, which I love. So I'm very happy I picked him up. And I just love the detail, like the um, checkers and then the like board stand he stands on i mean i just love him so much and then he has the dice in his hand he's just a cool little decoration and i'm not going to lie i do actually have him out all year round because let's be honest you can't tell he's a christmas decoration if you took this off so i just have him out all year round as like an ornament and then at the bottom of course tim burton's nightmare before christmas so, my favourite villain item. Now, my favourite Disney Park outfit, I've always dreamed of going to the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. And obviously, if I went to that, I would get to see the Hocus Pocus live show and everything. Like, one day, I want to go to that. And I've always dreamt of going to it in my... Hocus Pocus shirt with just some black skinny jeans and probably with some um, flat shoes because I don't want to make my feet hurt. But I would definitely wear this Hocus Pocus shirt to the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. Now it has come down to the last question. And it is my favourite piece out of my entire collection. Now this was actually hard to choose from because I own a lot of Disney. And to be honest I was actually going to choose one of my Bolt plushes. As you can see behind me I have a lot of Bolts. But I've gone with some limited edition dolls. One because they remind me of my childhood. Two because I used to go to the forest every single Sunday when I was little and free because I just love them so much it's not very often animal Disney animals get created into limited edition dolls it's normally the villains or the princesses or princes so I thought I would choose this one can you guess what it is it is my Disney designer Robin and Marion limited dolls collection there we go so they are my limited edition dolls. Now as you can see I tend to keep them in the sleeve because I am working on this very heavy. I am working on a little like shelf because these are the only limited, limited edition dolls I'm planning on getting because all my other favourite characters I doubt they will do. Like if they did a bolt one of course I would get that. Now I actually got these really cheap 
Like when they first came out, there was I think hundred and fifty pounds. I managed to get them at a bargain price of twenty five pounds. I know. So there's Robin and Marion in her wedding dress, and I just love the detail to them. I will do a close up version of them. They're just really heavy. <laughs> But they are my favourite piece out of my whole Disney collection. I just love them so much. They're so beautiful, so detailed and I just love them so much. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Everyone I know has already done this Disney tag because I am late to the game. Unfortunately, I've been too busy to film so i'm just going to tag whoever's watching this you who are watching this i tag you to do this disney video thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed if you'd like to see more of my videos please consider subscribing it would really mean a lot to me and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up thank you bye